Uh, thank you, Wub. I was going to put a super chat anyway as appreciation for past vids, but since I'm here, I put a post on Reddit about getting the error ESCCCCC, and I don't know where to start as black box isn't working. Just record static variables. Where on... So I am incredibly grateful for your super chat, which is very generous, and would like to go to Reddit to look up your problem. Uh, but you can't link to it because... Hold on, bear with me. I have an answer. You have an answer? Oh. Uh-huh. Oh. You have an answer? I think I found the post. Yeah, I have an answer. Damn, Valenti. I will post it in live stream chat. Okay. This looks like the question. It's the same question. Um... Yes, C, 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 C. Interesting. What is that? This is an ESC temperature alarm. Betaflight has a flag in the CLI called e- OSD underscore ESC underscore temp underscore alarm. If you set that to negative 128, you will never see this again, and it is not useful because we don't care about the temperature of the ESC. I mean, even if you did care about the temperature of the ESC, most ESCs don't have a temperature sensor anyway. Um, so first of all, kudos, Blunty. That was some hell of troubleshooting. Can you tell me the flag again, please? Sure. It is um, OSD underscore ESC underscore temp underscore alarm. Okay. So what you're looking for is OSD ESC temp underscore alarm. And you and set it to... The, well, you can't so set it to... Two different, ne- yeah. So there's... So on older beta flight, it's mm-hmm. negative 128. In newer okay. beta flight, it's zero. Whatever the lowest on the allowed range okay. is there. So it'll either be negative 128 or zero in your version of beta flight. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the beta flight CLI and you'll type get OSD ESC temp alarm, just like I did. And it's either going to say allowed range minus 128 to whatever... Or it's going to say it's probably minus 128 to 128 because it's probably a single byte. Or 0 to 255. And what you're going to do... Hang on. You're going to go and you're going to type set OSD underscore ESC underscore temp underscore alarm equals and then that number, 0 or minus 128. And then you'll type the word save. And that will disable that. Yes, and this can also show up, for some reason, it's version-based, maybe. It's either mm-hmm. CCCCC, RRRRR, or TTTTT. Basically, if you see ESC with a bunch of letters repeating after it, it's a temperature alarm. This person seems to think it's an overcurrent alarm. I don't think that's true. I don't think there is such a thing. Like, what's the overcurrent? What, what current would be overcurrent? Here's another one. No. It is OSD possible. ESC current alarm. Are you sure CCC isn't the current alarm? I did fix somebody with CCC before. I'm almost positive. But I, then I, I looked up a GitHub and it said TTT and RRR. But well, it sounds I like could be TT. mistaken. Huh. I mean, this is on GitHub. This is on Betaflight GitHub, which suggests that it's authoritative. Either way, so that so maybe just do set alarm and look. Are there any more? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's go back to beta flight. What? What's the current threshold though? Oh no 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 no! I don't want that. Come on. Uh, yeah, just to be clear, uh, that question asker is saying the temperature is an OSD, and if I set it as correct, current limit is off an AM32. Yeah, we're not talking about settings in the ESC firmware, unless there's a somehow coming back over DShot. This is, I believe these are like um, okay, some kind of settings inside a beta flight. Correct. Like these are in the so CLI. So we've got, we've got several alarms. The OSD ESC okay. temp alarm, the OSD ESC RPM alarm set to minus one, OSD ESC current alarm set to minus one. So you definitely want to this, set these to minus one to disable them is what it's looking yeah, like to me. Track, then this would track with the three that I had already, which is TTT, RRR, and CCC it would probably okay. be these three. So T is going to be temp, R is going to be RPM, and C is going to be current. And that's the one that this, we would, this user is experiencing. Why is he getting this? Why is this even turned on? If we go to the OSD tab, I've only tab, seen it twice at this point. Where where does this even come from? 
Let's go to the OSD tab. Hang on, let me zoom in. And look at, like in the warnings, do we have a warning for this? No, these are warnings. This appears to be a CLI option only, interesting. And it's off by default, so how did it get turned on? Weird. Anyway, we've answered your question now. Um, I don't know where this current threshold is coming from or what, what what's causing it to go off, or, but disable it and never think about it again would be my advice.